I put a spell on you And now you're mine Hocus Pocus has been a Halloween classic since its release in 1993, but there has definitely been an increase in popularity in the past couple years. We got an influx of cosplayers and parody videos, and now a performance at Walt Disney World featuring the Sanderson sisters. Now I'm not complaining. I love me some Hocus Pocus. So to honor the film this Halloween season, I'm going to give you some fun facts and trivia that you may not already know. Let's begin. In an interview, Bette Midler, who of course plays Winifred Sanderson, said that Hocus Pocus is her favorite film that she's ever done. She's done a lot of movies, so that's kind of saying something. Hocus Pocus was originally supposed to be a DCOM, a Disney Channel original movie, but the script caught the attention of a few higher ups at Disney and they thought it was strong enough to be a theatrical release. In the movie, of course, the Sanderson sisters are hung in the very beginning for being witches during the Salem witch trials, but what's funny is that Sarah Jessica Parker, who plays Sarah Sanderson, was on a TV show in the early 2000s called Who Do You Think You Are? It was a show that researched into celebrities' pasts, and through the show she found out that her great 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 grandmother, or her 10th great grandmother, was arrested during the Salem on witch trials for acts of witchcraft and for choking her neighbor. She escaped with her life and her accusations died with the Salem witch trials, but Sarah Jessica Parker has said that it was a life-changing realization to find out that her ancestry was actually involved in the Salem witch trials. Coincidence? Probably. Sean Murray is the actor who plays Thackeray Banks, but Jason Marsden is the voice actor for Cat Banks. To keep things consistent, Jason Marsden dubbed over the live action actor of that Green Banks. So it's never actually Sean Murray talking. Jason Marsden, by the way, is the voice of Max in Goofy Movie. Also, we met him at D23. Humble brag. During a 20th anniversary screening of Hocus Pocus, Doug Jones, who plays Billy Butcherson, revealed that the moths that come out of his mouth when he rips his mouth open for the first time were not CGI. They be real moths. That's disgusting. Oddly enough, this movie was not released in fall 1993. It was released in the summer, which is part of the reason why it didn't do so well with box office sales. But it did alright in the end. Now it's like a Halloween favorite. Am I right? You know Satan, who the sisters meet on Halloween? He's played by actor Gary Marshall, and his wife, Medusa, is played by his sister, Penny Marshall. That's a little gross. But I guess the family that works together stays together or something. The role of Max Dennison was originally offered to no other than Leonardo DiCaprio, but he turned it down in order to do the film What's Eating Gilbert Grape. Similarly, Rosie O'Donnell was originally chosen to be Mary Sanderson, but she declined the offer because she didn't want to play a scary witch. I personally don't find Mary that scary. She's pretty funny and she rides a vacuum. Rosie's loss. During production, the cast took a trip to Salem to do research for the film and it fell on the 300th anniversary of the Salem Witch Trials. Coincidence? Probably. Did you know, in many other countries, this movie is called Abracadabra. It's not just a bunch of Abracadabra. Can you imagine Max saying that? I can't. And finally, my favorite fun fact about this film, being a YouTuber myself, is that Emily Binks Little Emily Banks grew up to be a famous YouTuber. Maybe you've heard of her, the Venetian Princess. So there you have it, some fun Hocus Pocus trivia that you can share with all your friends this Halloween season and impress everyone. If you learned something new from this video, let me know in the comments down below or share some fun trivia that I may not have included in this video. Be sure to give us a big thumbs up and subscribe to Thingamavlogs if you have not already. And we'll see you next week for, oh, I don't know, what is next week? October's over, what's our theme gonna be? Ooh, I guess you'll have to check back in to find out. See you guys real soon. Bye! It's been 300 years. I love the day.